Good afternoon and welcome to another video of MechWarrior Online. Today we are taking a look at the Cicada CDA3FL for loyalty, although it's very similar to the 3F, not much of a difference except for this weird friggin' paint job. Uh, well, the paint job itself is the colors I chose, but these, these gleaming hexagonal tiles on this mech, which is kind of weird. Let's take a look at the build. Uh, in the mech lab today we have four meat pulse lasers, an XL325, three jump jets, and two double heat sinks. And that is it. We have full armor on everything except the arms. Um, they, I just kept the arm armor just to protect the torsos a little bit. I suppose I could have pumped uh, a little bit more into, actually, not much. Uh, probably could have taken some out, maybe put another heat sink in, give myself a little bit more heat management. But it plays very well as is, uh, and uh, I like the way it works. Um, so we have, um, take a look at the skills here we've got set up. We have part of the firewall, firepower, not the firewall, the firepower tree unlocked. We have the laser duration nodes, some of the range, uh, heat gen, and some of the cooldowns. We have the right side of the armor tree. I know that we don't usually put a lot in survival uh, on uh, mediums and lights, but I like to sort of skirmish in your face kind of thing, so I added a few more points there. Absolute full mobility, maybe not needed this much in here, but that's the way I went with it. Uh, just a few in uh, jump jets, uh, although I'm probably going to remove those and maybe add them somewhere else. I was thinking of adding them over here under auxiliary. Um, we have um, one extra consumable slot, which we're using a RD strike in, which I didn't actually use in the video. Um, I didn't have it set up this way at the time. Well, actually, I think I did. Sorry about that. I did have this set up in there. I just didn't use it. Um, I was thinking for using it for uh, maybe getting down, having some fun with a little bit of capture assist in here. So one, two, three, four, or use the enhanced cool shot, uh, maybe five, six. But as it is, this is the skill tree uh, the way it is for the video. I hope you enjoy this video. Stay tuned for more. Please hit that subscribe button. Stay safe and see you on the battlefield. Okay, we are in the Chiqueda, Cicada. Fast little zippy mech, four meat pulses, jump jets, and all the skills unlocked to boot for this beast of a mech. It certainly is fast, it doesn't stand toe to toe with larger mechs, uh, but it does uh, hold its own against lights, uh, assuming I can actually shoot straight. <laughs> Right now we're just going to get in the circle and hide. Now that we're in the circle, come up here and we'll wait. Not too long, but just a little bit. Just a little bit. Wait for others to get here. Problem with heat vision is sometimes what looks like trees is actually a mountain and I just walk right into one. But that's okay. Come around the outside and see if we can uh, do something here. Urban mech, that's not a good target for me, but. Shadow Cat Golf coming around the back, need some help. D6. Okay, let's go to his rescue. Go, but with the speed on this Mac, it won't take long to get there. Not the only one coming around. There we go. Now where's that shadow cat?
Same on you. Get up here anyway. Got it. Nice one. Alright, we barely miss crapping out our legs there. I'm very bad for that. I use all my jump juice for getting into where I want to go and I don't save enough for doing what I need to do with it afterwards. Yep, I'll take a few shots there. Hopefully not too many. Marauder in D5. Stand still, never stand still in a medium or light. Right, come up around here. They didn't see me. I think it finished. Oh, they knew I was here. I am stuck. I am stuck. I am stuck. There we go. Not bad. And we gotta learn to change directions while I'm flying. That way when I land I'm going further away. Into it. Let's get into it. I won't get into it. I want his face on my mantle. Give me your face. Give me your face! Take a component. Or I'll take your face. It's my face now. You don't like it? Come get it. Oh, but you can't. You're dead. That's right. Oh shit. Pardon me, French. Oh, that's bad. It's so bad. But I'm hiding in a tree. No one ever looks up. Humans, they never look up. Oh! Joe got a man. Which is stupid. B, hey, let's hit override. What a thought. There we go. I'm gonna sit here and cool off for a second because I keep forgetting and I keep overheating and I don't want to do that. Let's just let it happen. Let's see, I want someone else to find the enemy and then I will help them engage. Because I am low on armor and there's one right behind us. Oh, and there's also one up here. Couldn't get up there, damn. Okay, we're going around, I guess. We are going around. Oh my god, seriously? Where are my legs? There we go. Okay. Now that I can see. Get my AMS on your life still see. Lost my leg. I'm not doing well. Ow. Kamikaze. 150 meters you need.
Oh well, I did what I could. Save the heat, it's too close. Missiles. See how this goes. It was a close game, that was really intense. Uh, that was uh, a lot of fun. Um, that's a cicada with four meat pulse lasers. Tough oh, little shit. piece of uh, gear. Marauder does here. He should be able to destroy a kit box. God, I hope so, especially when he's at, uh, what is he at? 85% health. Unless this kit box gets his friends. I think you gotta hit the other leg, dude. Left leg, left leg. The other left. There we go. Nice. 10 and 10, what do we got going? We got the Marauder left, and we have, uh, we have a DC Rifleman, oh no. Nice. Just go hide behind that hill and just let your heat drop a bit. Forward, forward. Hill in front of you that you can hide behind. Left a bit. Now they should be pretty well damaged. Hits carefully enough. Oh, okay, that tree is never going to bother them again. Notice how these trees don't catch fire. It must be a very, very damp environment. I would think. Come on, come on, you can do it. You can do it, bud. Just watch your heat. Tense. Oh, who's going to end up winning this one? It is basically a one on one because we have a DC, unless somehow he's come back to life. No, he is not. Uh, that would be very unfortunate to lose at this point. So basically, had we not had a DC, it's quite possible this would already be over, or maybe that DC would have died early. Who knows? Um, there was a uh, big difference. This is like a, a night hunt in the jungles of wherever the planet we are on here is. Who will come out victorious? Oh. Watch the circle too. If you can take his legs, you got him. Gonna get back in the circle. Nice. So we're not going to let this go on. Uh, DC in D8. Oops. Why not? No. Oh my god. Alright, so let's see the final score here. The final numbers. We will look at the numbers and we will crunch them. And then we will decide if we did good or not, yeah? Okay, so three killing blows, seven kill assists, two solos, two KMDDs, 692 damage done in a cicada. I know other people have done that, but that is just great. I love that. Components, flanking, hit and runs. Gotta love it. Let's take a look at the team stats. 
We have 510 top match yeah, in a cicada. Hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, stay tuned for more. We're uh, doing one today. Uh, we'll give you the stats, the builds, and we'll go over the skill tree as well, although I'm still making a few minor tweaks and changes to it. Uh, and then we will go to our usual schedule of regular video and then instant combat back and forth. Um, have a good day. Stay safe. See you on the battlefield. Please subscribe.